Hey friends, welcome back to the channel and if you're new here, hello and welcome. I post motherhood and lifestyle videos here weekly so be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. We are finally taking a family vacation to the beach which is about three and a half hour drive for us. Thanks to the pandemic and quarantine life, this is our very first family vacation and wow, I didn't realize how much I had to pack just for my two-year-old toddler. So my toddler is getting her own carry-on suitcase to fit all of her clothes and essentials. And if you don't already use packing cubes, this is a must-have to stay organized. I used to travel a lot pre-pandemic and pre-kids to multiple countries for as long as nine days and I only had a carry-on thanks to these packing cubes. They're serious game changer. So the weather during our trip will be sunny and in the 80s. So here are Ray's outfits. We will be in Ocean City, Maryland for three nights, but I have to pack more than just three outfits for her because she's a toddler and you know, toddlers can get messy at times. So I packed several dresses, some casual wear, and a couple PJs. I also threw in a few pair of socks for her just in case the place we're staying at has cold floors. The most compact and efficient way to pack these packing cubes is to roll up the clothes. You can pack way more clothes this way versus when you fold and layer it on top of each other. So here it is, there's still room for a lot more clothes in this cube, but this should be good enough for our trip. I'm using a smaller cube for all her beach essentials like her bathing suits, beach hats, swim diapers, a couple pairs of beach and swim shoes, and some sunblock. I have more sunblock in her diaper bag, but this is just extra. I'm also packing this portable fan to attach to her stroller or in the beach tent with us in case she needs to cool down. Then I'm just throwing in these beach towels. I decided to just throw my beach towel in her suitcase as well. And I'm also packing her bath towel right on top of it. And then I'm using another packing cube for her toiletry essentials such as her moisturizers, this booger sucker because she is currently getting over a runny nose, some saline nasal spray, her hairbrush, some hair clips, and her toothbrush and toothpaste, and of course some extra diapers. So I have more diapers and wipes in her diaper bag, but this is just extra to put in the suitcase. And excuse my toddler in these clips as she keeps walking back and forth grabbing things in and out of the suitcase. And lastly, I'm also squeezing this face moisturizer in here. This is what I use for myself and also for Ray. So now I'm just maneuvering some towels around for a better fit. And then I'm also packing her white noise machine, which fits perfectly in this empty space here. So even though we are traveling away from home, I still try to stick to the routine as much as possible and make it comfortable for her to nap and sleep as if she were at home. And I almost forgot these washcloths that I'll just pack into this mesh zipper compartment. And voila, Ray is packed and ready for the beach. So moving on to my stuff, I will also be bringing a carry-on and of course using packing cubes as well, but a lot less clothes for me than Ray. And these are just my maternity clothes I'm packing, which are all summer friendly, super casual, and just overall comfortable for me since I'm vacationing in my third trimester in this very humid and hot weather. If you guys have been watching my channel for a while, you know how swollen I get during third trimester. So here we are again, rolling it all up.
and I'm also packing this maternity belt for support in case we plan on doing a lot of walking. You know, my big and low belly needs some support right now. Then I am packing an extra pair of sandals for me and also an extra pair of sandals for Ray in this shoe bag to keep it clean from the other things in here. I'm also packing some beach hats and this reusable tote bag. Going to be using this water resistant tote bag for the beach. And okay, there goes my toddler just walking across my suitcase. Here are some sunblock and toiletries. I have travel sized face wash, shampoo, conditioner, body wash, my contact solution, some extra contact lenses, and makeup wipes here. Then I also packed some makeup, just very little, only the basics like foundation, concealer, bronzer, and eyebrow pencil. So I'm doing this voiceover right after our trip and I ended up using none of my makeup except for my eyebrow pencil during this trip. But anyways, in this smaller compartment, I have my extra camera batteries, chargers, and SD cards. Lastly, this smaller packing cube contains my bikinis, maternity bras, and underwear. I don't need to show y'all in detail because they're just boring granny panties that I love to wear during pregnancy because it's seriously the only thing that's comfortable. So don't hate on them granny panties, okay? And I also just threw in some deodorant and this leave-in conditioner in this cube as well. That's it for me. And in case you guys are wondering, what about my husband? I do not pack for him because he's a grown adult, but this is how he packs. He just shoves everything into a duffel bag and both our electronic toothbrushes and other toiletries are in this neat and compact toiletry bag. I could never pack this way because I'm too OCD, but it works for him. I am also bringing my laptop with me in this small tote bag and I'm also going to put my cameras in here. I don't plan on editing or doing any work on this trip, but I always feel the need to bring my laptop with me. So it'll be going in this little tote bag. All right, as for food, we are bringing this cooler. Putting, this is fruit punch for Ray. Apple juice. I mean, basically everything in here is for Ray, so. And then I um, washed and sliced up some fruits. We have apples here, strawberries, blueberries, and watermelon. Mixed berry yogurt. And then I have, these are insulated cups. This is orange juice in here and milk. She hates drinking milk, so this will last us for the weekend. So put in here, and then I'm gonna throw in some ice packs in here to keep everything cool. This is her insulated water cup. There's ice water in here for her. We hold this so you can eat it in the car. This is just a reusable placemat. We can wash down all her utensils, food scissors right here. Some plates, bowls, cups, an extra water bottle. And then we have an insulated, um, like these thermals. So when we go to the beach, I'm just gonna throw her fruits in here so that it can stay chilled. Oh, I'm probably packing this banana bread too because I just made it yesterday. I didn't want to waste it, so we'll pack this with us as well. I forget about this, children's Tylenol, prenatal vitamins. This is Ray's vitamins, my vitamin D, and iron supplements. So all this is going in here as well. You ready to go to the beach? Yeah! That's all I have for you guys. It's time for us to hit the road. So thank you so much for tuning in today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. And stay tuned for our vacation vlog next.